Alice Bell. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another weekly vlog. This is back to one week again instead of combining a couple. <laughs> so we're getting there and I've been trying to do vlog clips again but I don't think I did any reading in this one. It's taking me, it's like starting all over again trying to remember when to do stuff but the next vlog I'll have a reading in it. But I get some Halloween stuff in this and just some other stuff and it's just, I hope you enjoy it. just found a video. I'm not going to put this in it because it'll go in the next book haul because there's been others that come before it that it will be. So. I got book mail. I don't know what it is. Is this pink one? No, oh, yay! Yes, they did reach out to me. Thank you so much. I'm so excited. This is a highly anticipated release. Ghost Light by Kenneth Opal. And this comes out next month. And I am so excited. It sounds so good. This isn't out yet when I put this vlog up that shows this I'll edit in here the exact day it comes out I am so excited thank you so much oh it says on the package on sale date September 6th so yeah this will be getting bumped up so <sighs> thank you so Some much book mail so I thought I'd open it yeah looks forward to reach out to me and asked if they could send me a David Massey book I think this is the second book so I need to read the, I need the first one I think this is David Massey and the Hidden Underworld by Andrew M no. Thank you so much. If it hasn't come out yet by the time this goes up, I'll edit in here the release date. Otherwise, that means it's already out. But thank you so much. through some totes of some of my old stuff looking for two things in particular which I found but some of the stuff I found in another tote day before yesterday um, it's already in the book room and I'll show you all those later but it all started because I wanted to find my Elvis plate I only kept I think two things from my ex and this was one of them if I'm not mistaken he got it at the house I think it was the birth house or the house that Elvis in Tupelo, Mississippi. So, I'm not getting rid of that. <laughs> and I want to get a plate stand for it. And then my crow stuff, the original crow. The table. Love that movie, the first one. And a lot of films were made, films and TV shows, um, near where I grew up in North Carolina. And he, and this was one of them, and he actually died in one of our hospitals. So, I love how just randomly her hairs are everywhere. I just took this out of there, and there's one hair on it. <laughs> but, some of the other stuff in this one. seen it in theater. And some VHS's to put with some other ones I have upstairs. It seems like now they're just decoration. I got some book, I got some book mail so I thought I'd open it. Oh, oh this was coming. They had sent me an arc and I actually just started it the other night. So this is funny because it comes out this month. came out this past Tuesday actually. And it's The Wind Rises by Timothy Barry Pombell. Alma 1. Book 1 in the Alma. Alma. And they sent me a beautiful finished copy. That was so nice. I just started it. I'm just hoping nothing sad happens. And there's a horse. And I'm just worried. So, but so far nothing has happened. That's just always my fear when there's an animal. Well, thank you so much. That is so awesome. Some of the other stuff. My first baby shoes. I made this in school. And some other stuff I made, but some of it's broken. And I think I've talked about it on my channel. The one train ride I was on, where we hit on the way back, we were running late, and the train hit a guy that was trying to beat the tracks, him and his son, and they both died. Well, it was like a history field trip to a museum, and these were two of the things I had gotten on that field trip. Oh, yeah. 
the author reached out to me and asked if she could send me an arc of her upcoming release and I said yes because it's one of it's one of my most anticipated releases. I think it comes out August 30th. Three Strike Summer by Skylar. Huh? So excited. Thank you so much. And I will bump this up since it's coming out soon. Today is Saturday, August 20th. So thank you so much. From that walk it's my first one since she passed because we used to walk with her I tried to go a different way so it'd be less hard one that i didn't really walk with her for the most part today's the 20th it was eight weeks time's so weird it was eight weeks which would technically you think be two months on monday but the 20th is when she passed so now it's two months again because it's the 20th today but it was eight weeks Monday, so when I get to the point where the weeks get to so many and you stop counting weeks and you're just counting by the month, I won't be suffering twice <laughs> by two months as far as weeks go and then two months as far as the 20th. <laughs> so today's just, ugh. So I did that because I've been wanting to walk and I got some mace. And that just makes me feel better. <laughs> Walking as a woman. I found a video and I put it up already today of recent reads. I cleaned out my House in Wonderland room that has all the books I've read in it and my book room the other day, hung some pictures, redid my bookshelf in the bedroom. Not long ago I redid the one of the book carts upstairs for a video idea I have that I still need to do, but I think it's gonna take a while to film, so I've been putting it off because there's so many on the cart. <laughs> but, I'm gonna do that. I woke up, I didn't go to, couldn't fall asleep till after midnight last night, and then I woke up at four or something and couldn't go back to sleep, so I've been up since then, which is fun. I'm just waiting on it to get easier, like everybody says it will. Not easier, but a little better, at least. I started The Tarnished Garden, which was sequel or companion to The Gilded Girl by, I think it's Alyssa Coleman. Just started it, but liking it so far. And I started The Memory Keeper. I can't remember who that's by, but if I remember and start updating like I used to, <laughs> I'll show you later. Just started that one too, because I just finished another book so I started that. I'm almost done with the second Murder Most Unladylike book by Robin Stevens. I'm flying through it. I'm loving it so much. I'm on the third Poppy Pym book in the series and I'm loving the location this one's at. We've like changed location and I'm loving the direction it's going in. I'm reading the Alma book one The Wind Rises I think it's called. I'm reading Treks by Christine Morel. I'm loving that so far. And I wanted to start reading, because my graphic novels are in, like, in the book room, the closet. I have smaller bookshelves in there, too. And that's where, like, my classics are and other type books. And then I have one shelf that's for, like, YA adult. There's ones I've got from book boxes or ones that I had bought when I started in middle grade that I thought I might like. And then I continued to, like, Fairy Loot and just kept the ones I thought that I would probably like when if I ever do read something besides middle grade, which I don't see right now, but, and so I just keep the ones that sound like ones I would like. And then there's another whole other shelf that has graphic novels, and I have so many, but since they're in there, I never see them and I never think about them. I need to go in there, but for right now, I've got the second Lightfall. I think I'm gonna read that. Because I have so many graphic novels, I wanna read more of them, because I have so many. Not much food content, I just haven't felt like it. I made burgers the past two nights. Before that it was fish sticks. But the Instapot, I just, everything has a memory with her and like I'd use it and she'd be watching me laying in the bed in the bedroom, like looking into the kitchen watching me. Just everything is just, I don't know. I enjoy cooking even more when it's cold outside because there's even more recipes. And they're just so easy too. Like I love cooking, but 
just just such cozy recipes. So looking forward to that too. Second of August. I uh, just uploaded a vlog. It's like four or something. I had it ready like early this morning, and then my husband got off early and we went and did a bunch of stuff, so that didn't go up till late. So we went out to eat. My Samsung clips. He's been wanting to go to go to that place forever, Quaker Steak and Loop. We went out to Books a Million. Uh, the first book in a series that I've been. Thanks, Rachel. And I'll show these in a book haul and go more in depth. But first in the series, I've been eyeing Girl Stuff by Let's See. Harrison. I look up and I forever. The Last Human by Lee Bacon. And then an author that I'm so intrigued by, and I think it's right on the alley with the spooky middle grade. Hear the Wind Blow, a novel of the Silver Silver War by Mary Downing Hahn. That's all I got there. Then I went to the Spirit of Halloween. I'm gonna go back later on because I still don't have a lot of stuff. Like it says coming soon, more stuff. And then, like, some of the stuff I've seen online, they didn't have, like, because I guess they've been picked over. The Halloween wreath I have, like, pumpkins are falling off because I've had it for so long, and I need a new one. I kind of like this one. So, purple's my favorite color, and I love Beetlejuice, so. It's not so it's showtime. And at the checkout, that's where they get you all the cheap stuff. This isn't like glass or anything. They're only a dollar a piece. They had a Beetlejuice like shot glass. And a Nightmare Before Christmas one. And then some like two dollar cups. Realize the body of Emily Binks, beloved daughter. It's got the cat. 300 years is a long wait. It says Hocus Pocus. Christmas. And a little juice one. What do you want? <laughs> and this journal, I just love the look of it. It says 1693 Hocus Pocus. On all Hobbs Eve, when the moon is round, summon us from under the ground. back says it's a full moon outside. The weirdos are out. Just love the look of that. And so that's what I got. Alright y'all, that's it for this vlog. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you would like to subscribe, I would love that if you like to. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.